Welcome to Hardcraft Stadium, birthplace of the Micro Hard Mutilators. Today's game brought to you by Micro Hard Crash and Burn Technologies. Remember, in the MFL, we encourage you to play with your food. He's probably lining up against you. The New Orleans Zombies battle the Micro Hard Mutilators. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Hi everyone, Grim Blitzrow with you on MFL Game Day. Hey, uh, Bricks, do you smell something burning? Ah, oh, thanks for reminding me. I left my rubber foot in the toaster oven to warm it up. Last time I left it there too long, it came out like Saganaki. Oh, fuck! Uh -huh. It's freezing in here. Hey, why don't you take a shampoo and ouzo, stick your head in the toaster oven, that'll warm you up. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. down and ten. Hey. And he's running like a moose. He picks up eight yards on that pass. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy of three returns. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. Second down and two. And the defense jumps outside. Now the QB has to try to run out of bounds before they get to him. Needless to say, with seven crazed defenders coming after him, that's not easy. Ah, the old quarterback shellac play. Yeah. And it's first and ten. What a throw. And Sonic. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown. <laughs> well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And he's off to the races. Look at that little. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Just 
There's some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Whoa, and he laterals the ball to the player behind. And he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now. Shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting or dead. Say what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. You understand me? And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he put all of his foot into that one. The return man catches the ball and heads up field. Boom! And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And this guy just exploded into flames. Now the defense has to try to tackle a running bonfire. First and goal. The defense had enough with this ref and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> First and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. And he let him, and he runs it in for the touchdown.
And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. It's anyone's game still at this point. I know, which makes it so hard to place a bat. And it's first and ten. for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. And he'll pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. And it's first and ten. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. Three yards on that run. Second down and seven. Hot one, hot two. Eight. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawning. First and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot three. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Hey. 
goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. They're going to be able to return this one. First and ten. Man, he's running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. And it's first and ten. And it's first and ten. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. two-minute warning folks stay tuned for the halftime show third down and long hot. Hot one. Hey. Yeah, I don't know either, but scratch another player from the roster because he stepped out of mine and exploded his spine. They stunt the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. down in 10. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And there's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient. They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have nine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. One, hot two, hot Put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and 
kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. Get out this berserk, dirty chicken. Boom, dead and down. You delivered the freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Now, yeah, still working on my salami here, Briggs. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It's close, though. Yep. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Grim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. I don't think the funeral expenses, that is. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Second down and long. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Ah, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Hot. He got rid of it out of bounds. That's better than throwing a pick, I suppose. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where are we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? I'm gonna go to a strapeze show. Where are we going? Hey, once you settle down, just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. <laughs> the teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah. That's oh, with the brutal hit. <laughs> And it's first and ten. The ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong-il. He refuses to go down. Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. Tired of the quarterback's tight spiral. And in some leagues, you aren't even allowed to touch the QB. In the NFL, yeah. they have plays just for killing them. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. The offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break. They're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback calls a Sonic Blast dirty. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down.
First down and nine. Call man about a six yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Oh, that is such bullshit. I got money on this game. These guys need to talk to ref about those calls. If I talk, I mean, stomp them into the ground. Second down, and the offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down, and ain't gonna happen, partner. Well, that was a good throw. Yeah, if he was aiming for the ground. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. And it looks like the offense is desperate for a first down. And that play didn't have a chance. The defense comes up with a big... They might consider calling a kill the ref play. Just saying. Now this one's gonna... It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. Ballsy? Stupid, maybe? I guess we'll decide that he's got his beast boost working. The player just trained, and he runs it in for the touchdown. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one time thing. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Oh, no, no, it's a sticky ball, dirty trick. The defense pretty much turned the ball into a yo-yo of doom. Did you ever think you'd say that, Grim? A yo-yo of doom? No, my friend, <laughs> I didn't. I love this job. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. Bricks, they just made up a whole lot of field in a hurry with that pass play. And I just made up a new name for a sandwich. Third down and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. <laughs> this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot. And this guy runs angry and runs hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Say maybe 
33 yards, but a tough three yards. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And he just wrestles him. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. First and eight to go. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And that's a run for no gain. Second down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. The quarterback goes down. Zoom on his face. I want to see if he's crying. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Hot one, hot two. Hot. And they line up for the extra point. Hey. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. Second and three. Cannonball, first down. And my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. And it's first and ten. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. First down! I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. And into the end zone for a touchdown! Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot 
One, hot two. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Hot one, hot two. Hot, hot, hot. It's two yard run before he stopped. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one. Hot. You know, a lot of guys talk about stepping up their game, Bricks. He just stepped up and... And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this act, man. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. He runs it for three. Second down and seven. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. He turned into a mutant fireball with that flame on dirty trick. And anything he, he dies and fumbles the ball. And no one's going to his ship after the game. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's more of a downest guy than a speed seat friend. He's running from his team. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Second down and five. And then Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. This is your brain, and this is your brain on berserker drugs. And that is that guy's brain getting boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Huge pass play for one yard. Second down and nine. Perfect pass and the score! And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Oh, 
nice hit. And it's first and ten. Not, not one. It's going to shave a few days off his life. Second down and seven. Hot one, hot two. Hot, hot three. First down. And this guy is a stud, Bricks. Yeah, telling me. Nice run. No, I mean, he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. Hot one, hot two. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitter. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. <laughs> Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and, uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. <laughs> this guy's a brick shit house. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And it's and they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. And the offense goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. done for a first down and it's first they use their second time out but they're running out of time a uh, bit pessimistic don't you think so Grim? it's more about building tension bricks that's all we do at this point and drink this bourbon come on give me that <laughs> he caught it and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone except maybe self-doubt but he seems to have worked through it Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. The 20. He's at the 10. Touchdown! He takes it to the house on the kick up return and scores. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just... The Mutilators mutilated the opposition today and walk away with a win. The entire game was trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered, but in the end, there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that a feeder team should get a participation award because they are like trying really hard. Why don't you try real hard to shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the scots, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the game's MVP. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off.
Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. They get it right every...